Hello friends, welcome to Hello English. My name is Rupam and I welcome you all to my channel. In today's video, I will share with you three easy ways how you can improve your English fluency. In just six weeks, in just six weeks, you will be able to improve your fluency. You will be able to speak English very nicely and you will not be scared to speak in English. A very small lesson and some simple tips I will share with you today. So let's begin with the video. Yes, just a small request. If you like this video, please do subscribe. So the first way how to improve your English fluency is by listening. Listening plays a very big role in helping us to improve our fluency. When I was a kid, I never talked in English. I studied in English medium school, but the situation was such that with my friends, with my teachers, we always used to speak in regional language like Hindi, Assamese, Bengali, Nepali. So, slowly, slowly, my English became very bad. And if sometime anyone speak to us in English, I used to get very scared, very nervous, believe me, because I know that I'm not at all good in English. I can understand, but I cannot talk. My listening was also very poor. So one day I asked my class teacher, English teacher, Sir, how to improve English fluency? I want to talk in English. So the first mantra which you can apply is by listening, he said. So what to do? So I started watching some videos. Initially, I was watching videos made in India. It is because I am an Indian. And if someone from India speaks English, it will be easy for me to understand. Once I am comfortable with the Indian English accent, I can do something different. I can listen to some other speakers also. Yes, when I say listening, it should be at least 20 to 30 minutes every day. Remember this, 20 to 30 minutes of non-stop practice you have to do. You cannot take break in between, remember. You cannot waste time. So what you can do, play some video, whichever you like, and keep listening very actively very attentively what they are talking. First, let me play one small clip for you. I do remember the night my father died and I remember the, the driver of a neighbor who was driving us to the hospital. He mumbled something about dead people don't tip so well and walk away into the dark. And I was only 14 then. And uh, I put my father's dead body in the back seat of the car. And my mother besides me, I started driving back from the hospital to the house. And in the middle of a quiet crying, my mother looked at me and she said, Son, when did you learn to drive? So this is easy for me to understand because he is an Indian speaker. He's an Indian actor. So the accent is similar to what I can understand. In this way, you can start your listening practice. Once you are comfortable, then move on to something different. I used to do this. Now, as I'm comfortable with the Indian accent, I want you also to listen to a different accent from a different country. Why we don't believe that we can do it better? We have to believe, we have to be positive to try to change the things. This is why we have to, we are, we, we're not going to give up. You know, the, on, the only give up is the guy who is weak mentally. Well, I remember when I was 18, 19, 20, some old players speak with me, but I put that as uh, Christian, we have to improve. So, this is how you can start your listening practice. Got it, my dear friends? Let's move on to point number two. How you can improve your fluency. The second one is by reading. You have to spend at least 20 to 30 minutes every day to improve your fluency. Reading plays a very big role in improving our fluency. 
when we read we are not just only reading listen carefully we are also speaking out loud we are also talking in english and this is how our fluency develops so what to read you can read anything and you can read everything choose something easy at the beginning okay i will tell you how to read so this is a book i always is to read this book at the beginning because this book contains very easy easy lessons small small chapters with easy words and sentences so how to read let me read a small para for you when i was doing research for the monk who sold his ferrari i came across the story of an indian maharaja who could engage in a bazaar morning ritual every day immediately after waking up he could celebrate his own funeral complete with music and flowers so you saw how i read you need to read slowly understand what you read give pauses in between so that it help you you get the benefit and this will help you to improve your english fluency again one more tip i can give you if you want to read online just go to google.com and type english paragraphs for reading got it so the first one you can choose go here and see there are so many short short stories paragraphs five english paragraphs for reading practice many questions many answers vocabulary questions okay you can go and read in from this website lilypod.ai so we are done with listening we are done with reading the third one and the most important is speaking just imagine that you want to become fluent in english and you never talk in english how is it possible this is not possible right so you need to open your mouth you need to understand that in order to become fluent in english you need to speak and every day you need to practice at least for 30 minutes six weeks will simply pass by and if you are not consistent if you are not disciplined at the end of 6 week you will realize you have not learned anything so you have to be serious enough so how to start speaking well you can start by your own i would say if you don't find anyone just stand in front of the mirror take a topic and keep speaking my favorite topic was my family and my friends why i took this topic why this is my favorite topic because i know these people i can talk many things about them non stop so remember whenever you are alone just try to talk to yourself simple words simple sentences small small sentences i love my mother my mother cooks good food for me my father he goes to office every day I have a brother. He is very naughty. He fights with me every day. This way, try to start thinking in English. It will benefit you a lot, my dear friend. One idea I can share with you. You have kids in your neighborhood? If you have kids, you can start talking to the kids. Kids will never judge you. Children will never judge you. So, if your English is not good, if you feel you are not confident, go and talk to kids they will also find interest they will also start talking to you and this way you the process of speaking will start inside you also if you have friends or neighbors or your teacher who is willing to help you in speaking that's very good speak to them this is how you will be able to improve your english so my dear friends the three steps which i shared with you The first one is listening, second is reading, third is speaking. If you follow this with full discipline, I am sure after 6 week you will be able to see the difference. People will say, "Wow, you started speaking English so well." 
people will love you they will start respecting you so my dear friends this is a small lesson if you have any question for me you can ask me till the next video thank you so much